Operation. So today we will be surprising Gox with his entire story painted in the watercolor sketchbook. So everything started with the Grandpa Gox. The Gox's home was filled up with Grandpa's painting and in the home like that it is natural to have the drive to create. Gox wanted to be like his grandpa, but in his own style. Every day, he wanted to create these crazy doodles. Every day, Gox would draw for fun in the school classes, in the library, in the swimming pool, making cool pictures from his imagination. And my yellow tape is a little bit too Ouch. strong. <clears throat> but also I haven't foreseen another thing. That I lack the most important paint color. The volcanic orange. Which is available to get only in one place on earth. Which is 3000 kilometers from my place. So of course I will not go to... Okay my brothers, the trip was totally worth it and I got the paint so now I can copy the Gox doodles. Gox started with doodles because they are fun. He decided to show his drawings to more people, so he put them on Instagram. He didn't do it for likes, he just wanted to share what he made. Gax also was watching a lot of artistic YouTubers, it made him want to make his own videos. He started as well as he could and he slowly started to learn. The editing, the transitions, the cinematography, slowly developing his style. <sighs> but since this is the most complex video I have ever made, I started to get overwhelmed. That there's one trick that Gox always uses. So Gox was slowly developing his style and he was highly inspired by gorillas and other animations. This is why he wanted to make his own versions of these characters. He wanted to make the characters in his own style. But the biggest strength of Gox wasn't his creativity or his artistic expressions. The support he gained from his parents was incredible. His mom was helping him as a camera operator, while his dad discussed the business and ideas with a young Gox. If you're watching this, and I hope you do, I have a challenge for you. So you are an amazing artist and you tried different, different mediums, but you haven't tried watercolors yet. So this is the challenge. Create another video in your style about making the watercolor picture. This is the challenge. And guys, check the comments below, maybe Gox responded. With this support, with this approach, with this team, Gox was on a way to create his own style on YouTube. So in his videos there are these recurring themes as pineapples, crazy doggos, spongebob, crocs and hating the color green. Gox was leveling up as an editor as well. After years of Instagram, after years of YouTube, he finally understood what YouTube algorithm wants, what viewers want. He finally learned how to create videos both artistically pleasing and impossible to click off. Gox finally understood the type of YouTube storytelling. From now, in each of his episodes, he is surprising his dad with his art, he makes his characters, 
and he is making them in his unique doodling style. This is how Gox became a YouTube pro. He gets subs and subs and subs. YouTube algorithm loves him. Soon the companies like Sony want to work with him. Gox started to monetize not even through YouTube, but through the brand deals. This is how you make the art your business. Gox has too many subscribers. But what would happen if he would drop the video editing course allowed only for subscribers? He would get 1 million subscriptions more just like that. Because if you think about it, YouTube subs are kind of broke. There is no fair exchange of money. YouTuber gets recognition, better deals, most for the algorithm, while the viewer doesn't get anything. Just cheating notifications. This is why people watch but they don't subscribe. And imagine what would happen if we would reverse that and I found a solution. Click the link in the description to check Subscriber Pro. Simple browser extension that will revolutionize and fix YouTube subscriptions forever. After huge success, Gox gets more mature. He is now traveling and shooting the videos on the go. The videos of daily routine things. He has two other channels, Gox and Gox2, where he drops short films with less editing, less effects. He is just learning cinematography on the go. So Gox achieves it. His videos are wholesome. Because in each video he has Character, cinematography, fun, editing, storytelling, crazy art. And powerful music. This is so inspiring for other creators like me. This is why I was creating this video day and night. I was painting so much that I ran out of paint. But luckily, my paint order is here. So with his success on YouTube, we still gotta see Gox as a true artist. In his unique style. His art is on a mastery level, in such a young age. And he is constantly going out of his artistic comfort zone. He makes paintings and his dream is to be exhibited all over the world with his painting doodles, but also he wants to create these big murals. He found his style, he achieved mastery in it, and now he is exploring diff different styles of art, like painting, filmmaking, also, I can bet we will see his short film in a while, because he's training for that a lot. Gox is a true inspiration for other creators. I know that I was highly inspired. So now Gox is the king of YouTube. With current 2.7 million subscribers, he seems like he achieved the dream of every artist. So the sketchbook I was making for one week is finally done. But while I was probably going through the pictures, I got the idea. As Gox was inspired by his grandpa, Maybe one day, he will be the inspiration for his grandchildren. Or maybe he can be the inspiration for you. So I decided to paint Gox as his future self. With this small adjustment, after one week of design and painting, now the sketchbook is finally done, done. Enjoy the reveal.